What's up everyone, Simulator Shane here, and today I want to show you my first simulator. So the high school that I went to had an aerospace program, and the year that I was in the program, the class had so little students that we had a little bit of budget excess. So my teacher came to us and said, what should we do with this extra money? Is there something the class needs? And me and a few classmates said, wouldn't it be cool if we could build a flight simulator? And he looked at us like we were crazy because you can't build a flight simulator for a couple grand, right? Well, we kind of proved them wrong because over our senior year, while I was flying for my private pilot's license, uh, me and a few classmates, we got some scrap wood. Uh, we built a computer. We mounted a projector on the roof. We installed speakers. And we sort of hooked up all these flight controls and pretty much built a cockpit of basically a Cessna 172 at our school. And it's still in use today. Like the thing works really well. And I go back there six years later and the students are still flying it every day. And it pretty much was like the best tool for the class because as the students were learning about aviation, like the theory of it in class, the students that weren't actually flying were able to try it out on the simulator and at least get like a feel of what it was like to fly an aircraft. Now, it's not the most advanced simulator in the world. Um, obviously, it's very limited in what it can do, but the spirit of this sim is so high because for what we had and what we worked with, we made something that was so much more than the collection of the parts. This simulator project really started my passion for simulators in general because I'll never forget the look on people's faces when they walk by and then they sort of turn around and walk back and have a double take. They're like, what the heck did I just see in that door? And then they sort of poke their head in the room and they, they see this different world that's like transporting these students into the cockpit of an aircraft, but in the middle of a school and they're sort of confused. And then they all ask straight away, can I try that? That looks awesome. And that's just really fun. Every time the school has visitors, they always bring the visitors to see the simulator because it's quite impressive and Probably the most impressive thing about it is the fact that it was built by students that were at the school at the time. And that's pretty unique. And even though the simulator was really fun, it was so much more than just a toy. When I was doing my nav exercises for my pilot training, I would actually use the sim to pre-fly the routes that I was going to fly the next day in real life. And it would give me a really accurate preview of what I should expect when I'm navigating between the airports, like what the horizon looks like, what the airport layout is like, and how I should approach the airport and things like that. And it was really useful. So I hope you guys liked seeing my first flight simulator. It was a lot of fun to build and I still enjoy flying it when I visit today. I'll see you guys in the next video.